34, the G34, that formed the PDP yeah. were essentially patriots. They loved Nigeria tremendously, every single one of them. And I'd like to say this few words on behalf, in memory, and uh, there's an appeal on their behalf to you, all of us that are younger ones. Nigeria must not break. Amen. Amen. And it's extremely important for people to take note of what well, I'm saying I'm on behalf of the elders. The founding fathers who came together and put Nigeria together as a federal republic were very highly inspired. Highly inspired because we need each other like this. At the last count, as an example, and just, just about a week ago, there are about 14 million men and women from Igbo land that are in the northern part of Nigeria. Mm -hmm. Over 14 million. And this is real. In my village, if you remove the Igbo community today, the, the place is lifeless. Mm -hmm. If you now come to the southwest, southwest, the number of people from Yoruba land in the whole of northern Nigeria may almost be nearly double of that 14 million. Because the traders and all the people, and they are all in their communities settled down and peaceful and really together. You can't even separate them anymore. This is reality. So anybody who is talking, some of them are abroad and so on, they don't know the reality of what it is. It is not possible. In this city I'm talking about, Abuja, 80% of the properties in this city do not belong to us, those of us who come from here. It belongs to other Nigerians. Who are here. Oh, and we have come because this area was selected. This is our area. I was teaching at uh, uh, Sulejana, I used to be Abuja, uh, Abuja Secondary School in 1966 67. Went through all these areas. All this area was selected. General Gowan, who selected the amount of land, announced deliberately chose here as a place where all Nigerians can be at one and at home. Because those of us who belong here, we are very welcome. There is the communities that are here, they love people. And we don't. And therefore, what am I saying? Nigeria must not break. Amen. We must be together. Amen. So I've mentioned the big groups now. The Igbo, the Yorubas, the House of Family. The ones that really Nigeria was created for. Because this, they can be nations. Right? An Igbo nation can be a nation if they want. Land, big people with big language, miss some a large you know, nations are like that. Yorubas can be a nation. The Hausa Flani can be a nation. We cannot be a nation. Because in my own area at all, these small, small people, we are over 200 little, little groups. And so therefore, when the amalgamation was signed in Lokoja, it was signed because the only way to bring all these small groups together is the federal republic, a federation. So I appealed to you and I went, I said it in just when we were doing the 20, 20, the, the 20 of this 2014 conference, I told our people that we cannot go away from Nigeria. Nigeria was created so that all the small, small groups can be together in one nation, together with the big ones. But if the big ones decide to go, after we've been pleading, pleading, we shall still remain Federal Republic of Nigeria. Yeah. Mm. And Abuja is our capital. Yes. We are saying, don't go. But if you want to go, we can go anywhere. <laughs> we will remain the Federal Republic of Nigeria with Abuja as our capital, because it's our land. Yeah, it is, uh... But our appeal is that no Nigerian can survive without the solidarity of the Federal Republic of Nigeria. May God help us. Amen. Amen.